So happy right now to me personally is definitely the person, the biggest person in the series that is alive. Let me clarify that is alive that has the best connection with Natsu. The reason why I say it's happy is because he's pretty much been with Natsu ever since he was born. I mean, happy <laughs> Natsu is technically happy's father. So they have a very special bond together. And I honestly like it a lot that those two, they've been together since day one. But I've been thinking. In the final fight, whether it be up against Zeref or Acnologia, me personally, I'm thinking maybe it's a little bit towards Acnologia that Natsu's going to have to find somehow how to trigger his E&D power. Now, I've been thinking maybe there's going to be some type of death between someone who's very close to him. Now, for starters, I think the three closest people to him right now that are alive are Happy, Lucy, and Grey. Now, for example, now for starters, I do not think that Lucy will end up dying because she obviously has a whole lot more. She potentially is going to lock a new power, something that might even make her become at on, on par with the Celestial Spirit King. And she just has a whole bunch of history. She's a heart failure member, so she's not going to die anytime soon, or she might not even die, period. The next one is Grey. Now, me personally, I think that Grey's death is still very possible within the series, but I don't think he'll be dying around that time. I, to be honest, I still think that Gray is going to have his major fight with Invel. Maybe then he could die, but I don't think that Natsu is going to be in the same. Uh, he's not going to be in the same location that Gray is going to be in while he's fighting Invel. So if Gray does end up dying, which I could see, but I can't see at the same time on 50 50, then I think it'll be to Invel and it will kind of be like a trade off. Like they'll both probably end up killing each other. So that's one thing. And that led me to one person happy. Happy, we know that we saw when he was fighting, when Natsu fought against Zeref. Even though Natsu had a super strong move that he was about to use to obliterate Zeref, Happy dove in there to save him. And in due to that, uh, him going in to save them, we saw that Happy was injured himself too. His paws were burning and everything. Like, he didn't care. He wanted to save his friend at all costs. So this led me to believe him. What if Happy ends up doing something similar versus in the Acnologia fight, but this time he ends up dying? Now, me personally, I'm one of the believers that Happy's going to turn into a dragon. So maybe we'll be able to see a Happy versus Acnologia. You know, what if Acnologia, he ends up knocking Natsu down or something, and then Happy comes and fights and like he defends him, he stalls for him. But then later on, that actually leads up to Happy's death. And then we see Natsu awaken his E&D form. And I think that would be amazing. So overall what do you guys think about this scenario would you guys want happy to die and do you guys think that it's a possibility for him dying at the end of the series comment what you guys think down below subscribe if you haven't peace out